guys ever wonder to yourself, like, what was I actually thinking? Hey guys, welcome back. In today's review, we're gonna be looking at the Rubbermaid Power Scrubber. Now, I will lead by telling you so that the suspense is gone. I'm not a fan, I'm not a fan, I'm not a fan, and this is going back to Amazon. But before I send it back, I wanted to go over why, why I think this is a fail. So let me take full ownership. I did buy this product with my own money. I am as responsible for falling for this as anybody else. Guys, why did I buy it? Because you know when you're scrubbing like in the kitchen, behind the, the little faucets and in the bathroom, behind the, you know, it's like, it's just kind of a pain in the butt. So I thought, oh, well the kids are helping out more with chores now, this will be great. It'll be more fun for them, easier for me. But then you get the product, okay? Well, first off, it came in this box. Literally, it looked like this, which, okay, whatever. I mean, that's more of an Amazon thing. But I mean, Rubbermaid, if people are paying $40 for a product, you could, maybe give better than a paper box. And then it comes like this. Now, okay, this is great for presentation, but you pull it out of the box and then what am I supposed to do with all of these things? I, I'm just, I'm a firm believer that if a company designs a product like this, they should give you some kind of a storage unit. It doesn't have to be fancy or big or just, you know, something that you could click the parts into. Let me know if I'm crazy or that matters to you guys. The main problem is it's not rechargeable. You do have to use batteries. Now it came with batteries, but I'm gonna turn it on. Okay, listen. Okay, it's very loud. Is it strong? Yes. Is there an application where this could be good for somebody? For sure. Like if you spend all day, you know, cleaning up little tiny objects, all day, this, yes, 100% in a professional capacity, I would say do it. Does it work? Yes. Where's the problem? The problem for me is we dip it in like, you know, the little, the pink stuff, and then I would put it down, and when I would turn it on, it would throw the stuff everywhere. And that was true with any cleaner that I used because of how like, I mean, it was casting stuff everywhere, making a bigger mess. That was problem number one. Problem number two is when you're cleaning, I don't know about how it goes in your house, but we'll have like 10 different cleaners on the table, blah, blah, blah. You're not gonna wanna run over and switch out the head. You're just not gonna do it. So again, to my point, if they had made like a convenient little caddy where they were all snapped in and I could just have it next to me on the counter, switch out the heads, no problem. So let me show you if you're interested in this. To switch it out, you just pull it off, put it on, click it into place. Easy enough to switch out the heads. They give you lots of different little options. You know, this, this, this for like softer stuff. And this, I guess, to do like detail work. It has a nice little point. And then you have this one which is more like a scrub pad, and this which is more like a polisher. Does this product work? Yes, but for me, is it worth the hassle of having to keep this, which came completely crushed like this, and nowhere to store all of this, and then every single time I use it, I have to go get the heads and switch them out and all. No, it, it's just not, and I'm gonna tell you why. It really feels like, a, what do you call it, hyper consumption, where, you remember when people used to use these things to clean their hands? Yeah, so I mean, I feel like, and no, this is not a scrub daddy plug. I actually just bought these last weekend and tried them. I like these, but even if I didn't have a scrub daddy, which I now do, and I'll be doing a review on this, two little paws and a scrub brush and you'll be fine. I mean, I would say that you could do the exact same thing with a toothbrush. The only way that this, like when I was scrubbing out the inside of the, um, you know, like in the sink, you have the little catch that catches like the little food. Okay, you could just use an old toothbrush. I don't know, I just think that we're reaching an age of ridiculousness where you would have this kind of sitting around your house for everyday cleaning. Again, I bought it, so I'm as guilty as the next. Guys, for me, this is going back. It is a fail. If it were rechargeable, I think I would consider keeping it. But the fact that I was aware at every second that I was using that like, oh, I'm burning through battery and boy, I could really just be doing this with my own hand. That's where this product fell short for me. Yeah, the idea of burning through four AA batteries for something that I could do with my, you know, one of these. I don't know, guys, it just, it just, it left me wanting everything. The reason that I purchased this is we purchased, you know, that viral one that has like the long wand and the scrubbing and what, but the problem with that one was that the wand was so long that you really had trouble applying enough power to get it to do anything. So I thought, oh yeah, well this will be a cool middle ground, but it's not because A, this isn't big enough. Like when I was doing the counters, I would never use this because I'd be there all damn day. A nice try, you, if you're like a hobbyist and you're cleaning things like tiny little things all day, then yes, does, again, does it work? Yes, it does. Is there a justification for me to have all of this in the house? I mean, it's one of those, right? 
for me, it's a no, it's going back. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you guys enjoy reviews like this where you just have a real person, that's me, telling you their honest to God opinions about the products that they're buying and using in their real life. And sometimes guys, unfortunately, it's gonna be a fail. It, it, I just don't love this product. For the right person, could work. But for what I was using it for, which was just general cleaning, no, just no. Then consider leaving a like, a comment, subscribe, or even share with another savvy friend. Because guys, we're all running households and we all have real problems that we're trying to solve. And that is the whole purpose of this channel is to find the products that actually work, that make life easier. I hope you guys enjoyed that review and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.